For whatever reason, you're looking for an XML sitemap for your Squarespace website. It's not immediately clear where this resides, how you even create one, and it almost feels like your website just doesn't have one. But luckily, that's not the case. So in this video, I'm going to walk you through how it's put together and where to find it. Okay, so I'll be honest, this was slightly clickbaity because with a Squarespace website, you don't need to generate or make an XML sitemap because Squarespace pretty much does it everything for us. So basically, all you need to do is go to your website and then you're going to want to go into the URL bar and then put sitemap.xml. And I'll show you that in a moment, but I just want to quickly clear up this myth. So people think that you need to make a page with a full sitemap and update it constantly. You don't. If you make changes on your Squarespace website, Squarespace is going to update your sitemap automatically within an hour. So Every single change that you make is going to be logged and it's going to be added to the sitemap almost immediately, realistically. So let's just quickly go into the browser now and I'll show you how to do it. Okay, right now we're on bycrawford.com. If you want a Squarespace website, this is who you get in touch with to build it. Now, all I need to do is forward slash and then sitemap.xml. Click enter and you've got your entire sitemap here. So you can see mine's pretty longish but you go all the way down and you can see it's got absolutely everything in here now it's not super pretty <laughs> but this is your sitemap so you don't need to make this it's automatically generated and automatically updated so whenever anyone asks you for your sitemap just literally send them this link get your domain forward slash sitemap.xml send that over to whoever's asking or you know if you just want to see it this is how you do it. So hopefully you found that useful. If you did, please make sure to leave a like and hit subscribe. And if you are made to build your Squarespace website, you can get in touch using the links in the description.